Good morning everyone. So today is going to be a different type of video. Basically I wanted to do videos that I enjoy and stuff so I have my first party of the year today. So I'll be taking you along the journey of everything. Um, I'm just about to show you what I take on these parties like what's in my kit and stuff like that because my kit has grown I did do um, what's in my face painting kit so I definitely leave a link up here or down in the description bar below so you can see from then to now how much my kit has grown um, I absolutely love doing it um, it's so much fun and yeah so let's get started with the day because i want to show you how i uh get ready for a party as you can so see this is uh, my kit um yeah so much stuff in my kit so basically i bought this the other day it's like um, a lighter style box. Um, so that would be good to put my name on there, my business name. Vicky's face painting and it lights up. So that would be so good on. And then I've got a little bin to put the rubbish in. And I recently bought this off eBay. It's a brush holder, so you can have it around your waist or on the table. And it's so much easier than just scattering your paintbrushes on the table. I made this, oh, I think a few years ago um, myself. I just got an old headband and just added these flowers onto them. So I wear this at gigs, which is fun. Again, I love these diamonds. Look at these. So cute. And the kids absolutely love these as well. And then I've got my stand. So I can basically hold my board with the pictures on. This box here is a very, very good box. Let me just show you. So this box is the treasure box that I like. So these are my mermaid tails with gorgeous diamantes. Um, if I can find, I knew that was going to fall. Unicorns. So these will go on your forehead and you can just add glitter on the kids absolutely love these these go so fast when i have these on my table the kids just go for these straight away you've got different pretty designs um for the mermaid tail just so much pretty stuff so the kids absolutely love these so put that to one side in this box is all my paints. Some I made up myself like this one. Bought this one. Such pretty colours. And I'm using Diamond FX for the white and the black. And for the pink. Look how gorgeous that pink is. I get the small ones because the big ones I don't really need. So I've got two of these and then I just got some cheap Zazaru paints that I don't normally have. This brush is amazing. It makes petals. So easy petals and then I've got my doublers, my dabbers and up here I've got more paint brushes. So that is my paint kit. So, this here, 
which every kid will love in the end is my glitter kit so i put this on the floor loving the christmas socks <laughs> so this is my wonderful da -da 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 Glitter magic. So this is the glitter glue that I use. I always make sure that it's kid friendly and can use on the skin. So I have the fine glitter because when I'm doing the glitter tattoos, this fine glitter is so much easier than this glitter. So I use this fine glitter for the glitter tattoos and then these big chunky glitter I use to decorate the faces of the kids uh, this is Eve Cosmetic um, I got this on Instagram I don't know if she's still in business like little chunky ones fine ones gold so all different types there and then the bottom one is da -da -da -da, oh my business cards but this is for your hair so I'm using fantasy glitter fix hair gel from Superdrug this is amazing it sticks to your hair and the glitter just goes on perfectly I use the VO5 style edit wicked violet hair glitter biodegradable I hope I said that right so I've got three lots of them and then I've got the chunky star gold glitter and this, the silver star glitter and then I've got chunky blue and then I've got little purple ones and then like a light goldy one like copper so the kids absolutely love this it's very messy but yes they love it these are my business cards which i have to update i want to get better ones so they are my business cards very plain but i want to get better ones so these carry around on my parties so here i use these pockets for my glitter tattoos and they are so handy i got these off ebay i try and link everything uh in the description bar below for you guys but they are so handy they're not faffing around on the table getting messy um, and it's just amazing i use these little angel sensitive baby wipes fragrant free i always get fragrant free because the little kids could have sensitive skin or could be allergic so i always make sure i get the right baby wipes so that is the kit so I always leave the best thing till last um, is, are you ready because I love it so much, my new banner. Da, 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 da. Like, it is tall. Like literally, the woman that did this was amazing. The banner itself, this bit here, cost ten pounds. My logo up here cost five pounds, and the actual base itself down here cost twenty seven ninety nine. So basically, you buy the base for twenty seven ninety nine uh, from eBay. 
the banner and the logo itself is a fantastic woman on Facebook which I will link her page down below it doesn't have to be face painting she does any type of business banner that you want whether it's a babysitting banner whether it's anything cooking banner any type of banner and logo that you need and want she will do it so i'll definitely put her link down in the description bar below she don't just do this she does t-shirts and i think uh, business cards as well so definitely hit her up on that the link to the banner this thing banner thing uh is on ebay and it's 27.99 so again i will leave the link to that in the description bar below and basically what will happen is the woman will do your banner and your logo she'll send it through your email and then once you purchase the banner applicator itself they will then send you an email to send the link to your banner and your logo so you don't have to send anything through the post it's not going to cost you anything you just send it all through email once they get your banner thing then that's when they will print it up like this massive thing that big but yeah i absolutely love it and get yourself one i reckon so yeah it's very uh very statement um it was when i first got it very fiddly um but i am going to see if i can show you how i put it down hopefully you'll be able to see it hopefully you'll be able to see me put this down so basically it's massive so if i come up this side try and turn it around so you have the pole right here pretty simple and then at the bottom you have a slot so you just slot it in obviously it takes a bit of fiddling around because once you get it in sometimes it topples so you've got a, a lot of fiddling around so what i've learned from watching facebook videos and that uh youtube videos and stuff is you start from the bottom so you lift the bottom up do you hear that and then slowly bring it down so it's down like this so, and slot it in like this these three bars just attach like so so then you have these hooks like you just turn it over place it like this and then some of them because a lot of them are very different um, there's a slot hole here to put your bar in there safely it comes with a bag which is ideal so you just slot it into your bag safe it's quite fiddly so you just have to be patient with it but you have to like move it around there you go, just slip right in like that, making sure everything's in place. It's a yeah. event now. So, why don't you come along with me? Come on, let's go. Mm -hmm.
Hey guys, so just got back from the event as you've seen. Um, very, very busy actually, so it was good. Um, if you're thinking what this is, I forgot to show you this earlier. Um, this is just a normal, actually it was a whistle that was on the end of this, a whistle. And I thought my stencils were very all over the place. So I am in a face painting group on Facebook and one of the blokes said that he uses this and puts all his stencils on his thing and it is definitely definitely <laughs> worth it because it took me less time to search the table for the stencils that they want it was on my my neck i just clipped through which ones i wanted and bingo i i've gone so now that i'm back um i have to what i normally do i sort out my kit what paintbrushes because with this coronavirus stuff going around us as face painters seeing if i can us as face painters obviously struggle with this a lot of cancellations to parties and stuff so we have to be extra careful so we wear gloves when we're face painting people um we i use i think everyone else does one sponge per kid so i have two separate bags i have one bag that has all my sponges in it and then i have another bag that has all my dirty sponges so i use one sponge per kid um i also wash my brushes as i'm going and i change the water every child basically um the water gets so dirty and you're just thinking of putting nah so i change my water every child that i'm using i also use a spray bottle to spray the paint so then it's not i'm using a lot of water in the pots to wash the paints so that will be tomorrow's do and that's what i do uh when i have a party on the weekend maybe a saturday sunday is to clean my kit out um making sure that when i do have my next party it's clean it's tidy um check what stock i need to get because at the range the stock at the range is amazing so if you've got a range near you and you're doing arts and crafts stuff or you're doing face painting the range has been a godsend to me <laughs> like literally a godsend getting all different di diamonds and gems and everything easter's coming up um which i have a party on that on easter sunday in breen Le uh yeah in breen um so i've got all different like headbands that i'm making uh, for the kids i just i love it so that is typically my party day so tomorrow i got home now i'm gonna have something to eat so i haven't had anything to eat today i need to start thinking of bringing food with me but gonna have something to eat relax and then tomorrow we'll be cleaning my stencils and my brushes and my sponges so <laughs> let's get on i'll yes. see you in a bit so it's been a long day and i thought i'll do something a bit different today so show you my sort of business side of it um i couldn't get a lot of video because obviously when it's kids it's not good so that's why i didn't it was only like my kit because you just you can't it's it's not right to do videos and pictures of kids and adults without their consent so that's why it's just my kit and stuff like that but it's something different on my channel and I thought I'm gonna start doing stuff that I like doing um, and hopefully you like it as well 
so it's another side of me um, obviously I'm in my pyjamas my hair is up I'm knackered <laughs> standing in one spot for a while but um, I got a, I got a lovely review on my page um, which is nice you know you're doing something right um, I might add the reviews at the end of the video or if not then let me know if you want to see the reviews or you can just go to my Facebook page Vicky's face painting uh, which I'll put the link down in the description bar below anyway so this is me signing off and I will see you again next time I am doing some filming tomorrow ready for next week I want to be on the ball this year obviously there's a lot of stuff going on which I said earlier about the coronavirus and all that so we've all got to protect ourselves but don't go manic with it so I'm signing off and I will see you again next time my butterflies bye guys